This video explains how to set up WhatsApp Gold alert notifications and notification policies. WhatsApp Gold Alert Center detects and notifies you of critical messages, failures, and other key events occurring within your environment. You can receive alerts when the performance of a network device exceeds a threshold that you have configured. For example, when a specified number of errors occur, or when a resource like CPU or memory usage exceeds a certain percentage over a given period of time. Alerts are listed in the Alert Center dashboard, but you can also configure WhatsApp Goal to send an email message when an alert is generated. To do this, you must first create a notification containing the email details such as the subject line and recipient's address, then set up a notification policy containing a sequence of notification steps in order to escalate an issue, and finally assign the notification policy to the alert threshold. Let's get started by creating a notification. Navigate to the Alert Center library and open the Notification tab. Click the plus icon to create a new notification, and in this example, let's choose Email. Please note that SMS and SMS Direct have been retired as of WhatsApp Gold version 22.1, but you may still see them in the list. Enter a name and description to identify the notification in the library. In the Receiver field, enter the email address to which you want to send the alert. You can enter one or more addresses, separated by a semicolon, comma, or space. The other values are filled in automatically from the SMTP server that you have pre-configured to work with WhatsApp Gold. Moving to the Alert Center tab, you can set up the subject and body of the email message. The default subject line contains percent variables that will pass the corresponding information from WhatsApp Gold into the subject when the email is generated. You can edit the subject line if you want to using the System and Alert Center drop-down menus to pick the variables you want to use. At the time of this video, the body of the email message cannot be customized, although this feature is planned for a future WhatsApp Gold release. However, you can optionally include a hyperlink to the Alert Center. Here's an example message for a ping response time performance alert. You can see how the percent variables in the subject line are replaced by the actual data. The body of the email lists the devices out of threshold along with the value that caused them to exceed the threshold. In this example, it's a number of milliseconds, but depending on the threshold, it could be a percentage, a quantity, or some other value. You can create multiple notifications to be sent to different groups of people in order to escalate an ongoing issue. For example, you might want to notify a small number of people with the first email message, then a larger team or more managerial level staff with the second and third emails. This example shows three unique notifications that are ready to combine into a notification policy. On the Notification Policy tab, click the plus icon and give the new notification policy a name and a description. Next, click the plus icon to add the first of three escalation steps to the policy and select which notification should be used for this step. Step 1 sends the notification immediately after a device exceeds the threshold. Optionally, you can also choose a blackout policy for the notification step. For example, if you do not want to send the notification during certain hours of the day, click OK to save Step 1. When you add Step 2 of the policy, you again select which notifications you want to use, and then you see an additional option to specify how long to wait before this step begins. For example, you might want to send Step 2 one hour after sending Step 1. Next, add Step 3, select one or more notifications, and again specify how long you want to wait before sending Step 3. Keep in mind this time interval is in relation to the start of the notification, which is Step 1. Let's set this to 2 hours to ensure Step 3 takes place after Step 2. You also have the option to repeat this step at a configurable time interval until the notification is addressed. This feature can be helpful to give an ongoing reminder about the issue. Only Step 3 has this option because it is the final escalation step. Please note, in a future version of WhatsApp Gold, you may see a new step to notify you when the device is no longer out of threshold. At this point, you can save this policy to the library, and you are now ready to assign it to any of the alert thresholds in your list. 
Thank you for watching this video covering Alert Center notifications and notification policies in What's Up Gold.